WFNN. Headline News Update. Good afternoon, everybody. I'm Tommy O'Brien coming to you live from TFNN, 1 p.m. Eastern Time on Friday. Three hours left to go in the trading day. And we have markets just under negative territory right now. Pretty muted day so far in the markets. It's Jobs Friday. Right now, S&P's negative two points, trading at 32.74. We've got the Dow negative by 71, trading at 28,886. NASDAQ minus three points. Currently trading at 91.99. We've got gold up six dollars at 15.60. We've got oil off about 28 cents at 59.28, and the dollar index off 108 ticks at 97.34. We'll start things off. I have a chart of the S&P up here. S&P futures. We'll start it off 32.73. You can see the low that we made just after noon Eastern time at about 32.68. Overnight, a new high in the S&P is 3287. Pretty remarkable. We had 29,000 in the Dow today, 3300 reachable in the S&Ps. We'll jump over to some of the other indices. Pull up that chart. There was the Dow. There is the Dow, I should say, and there we were, above 29,000 early overnight, back above that level at about 6:30 a.m. this morning in the futures, currently trading 28,860. NASDAQ 100 futures, March futures contract back above 9,000, trading at 9,008. We covered the S&Ps over about the last hour. We've traded up about five points at 32.75. There's your crude oil market. We were as high as about 59.80. We were below $59 just prior to 11 a.m., currently trading 59.20. There's your gold contract catching a bid on the jobs number this morning, 145,000 jobs added. We'll jump over to that in a moment. We pulled back initially, but from there, gold's traded up about $10 from that level we were at at about 9 a.m. And the euro U.S. dollar trading at 111.23. As I mentioned, Jobs Friday, non-farm payrolls for the month of December, 145,000 jobs added in the month of December to end out a banner 2019. And where are those jobs? There's your chart, CNBC article, the top sector, retail, 41,000, leisure and hospitality, 40,000, education and health, 36, construction at 20, and from there it goes down. Stay tuned, folks. We got our man Steve Rhodes coming up live right now with the Trader's Edge. Dave White will be live at 2 o'clock with the Power Trading Hour. And Tom O'Brien wraps up the trading week live from 3 till 4. Stay tuned, folks. We'll be right back with Steve Rhodes 